It's been nearly two and a half years since Hurricane Harvey blew through the coastal bend. Port Aransas, of course, was one of the hardest hit communities, but today that city turned another page in its recovery as a popular public spot reopened. Chris 6 News reporter Catherine McGinty was there for the celebration. Doors and books were reopened Saturday morning at Ellis Memorial Library in Port Aransas. I am really pleased and I love it. I've been a volunteer here for a long time. And everyone seems to approve of the new space. It's really good. I really like it. It's really a bright, open feeling to see so many smiling faces and all the, all the books on the chair. Everything looks open and bright. It just gives you a good feeling. But it's been a long road. The library was in the middle of a big expansion project in 2017. And then Harvey hit and it really devastated the library. All the collection was ruined. It's taken about two years past the hurricane, almost two and a half years, to finally get to you know where we are today. This is one of the first permanent buildings to be reopened in Port Aransas since Hurricane Harvey. And a lot of people came together to make it happen. A large portion of the books on these shelves were donated, some even shipped from other states. Making it possible for the community to gather at what they say is the heart of the city. It just, it just re reaches such a, a wide spectrum, you know, individuals, families, uh, locals, winter Texans, and, and so it's, it's just a really important focal point. Bringing bookworms of all ages together. I really love books. Every time I go to the library, I check out really fun books for me to read. And it gives me education, and I really love reading. I'm so glad for the community to have the library back. Catherine McGinty, Chris 6 News.